What's up guys, Matt from Vapeviews.com here, back again helping to keep you up to date with the latest in weed news and tech. So touching on some uh, 510 thread vapes now guys, I recently caught both of these 510 thread discrete vaporizers from Aristech. So if you don't know what a 510 thread is, if you've ever seen these disposable dab cartridges before, or even disposable e-cigarette tanks, the threading on the bottom that connects it to the battery or vaporizer is usually referred to as a 510 threading. So there is slight variances, like pod systems, etc. utilize a completely different motor cell brine to get the vapor from the device to your mouth. But this is definitely the most common style that I've seen and most cannabis dispensaries and outlets will even sell their own uh, concentrates or cannabis derivatives, distillate, etc. in these cartridges. So if you're living in a country where they have legal cannabis available like Canada or some of the states of the US, try and check out these uh, 510 thread concentrate atomizers in your dispensary. They're a super easy way to get a bacon on, on the go, very discreet and they're pretty cost effective for the amount of puffs that you get out of them. So both of these devices I said are equipped with 510 threading, meaning that you can connect your 510 thread cartridge directly to the atomizer here and get your vapor happening. So the Aeris Tick, which is the one that I'm holding right now, looks kind of like a lighter. So if you're on the go and staying in a place where weed isn't maybe that tolerated, you got something like this lying in your uh, bag or in your pocket, no one's gonna really look at it for what it is or take much of a uh, second glance at it. But it's super discreet, super easy to use. It's got this five pin uh, micro USB charging cable in the side here. So if you've got like a Samsung uh, phone charger or anything like that, you can keep this one loaded up on the go. It's also equipped with a number of different uh, voltages as well so you can change that up you just click three times so five times turns it on holding it down helps the thing to heat up you can see the little led light indicator just by looking in the side here so when you look through the little five pin micro usb hole clicking that three times changes the voltage up so green being the lowest then up to blue and finally red to finish off with so if you're dealing with a thicker oil or something with a bit less viscosity you want to be looking with that higher voltage to get the vape on but generally I just like to put it back on green and start it quite low. So looking at the Aeris Turbo now, so this is the latest in their line of compact 510 thread vapes. And this one looks kind of just like a key fob. So they've actually got an included leather tassel which you can attach to this thing. So you can either hang it off your keys or just have it in your pocket and people really aren't gonna know what they're looking at. It's even got the fake buttons, so it's ultra discreet, very lightweight, it's also got the five pin, the USB charging cable in the base here, and it's just the one button method of operation. So clicking that three times does the same deal, just changes the voltage up. So you can switch between a number of voltage functions there before putting it back to green. And obviously just holding that button down while inhaling through the cartridge. This is what's going to deliver you your big hits of vapor. So that's basically it guys. Two super simple vaporizers. Very discreet, easy to use, and they won't break the bank. Thanks for watching and remember to subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with the latest in weed vaping news and tech.